Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to build a sales funnel that is specifically designed to help you grow your email list. We're going to go ahead and create a new funnel together. So select funnels and then click on create. This time we're going to call it a list building funnel and then we're going to select the option build an audience. However, you don't actually need to select this template. You can select any of the templates and then edit it later. I'm going to stick to using the US dollar for my currency and I'm going to click on create. And there you go. Our list building funnel has been created. For the squeeze page, let's go ahead and select a template. I'm going to choose, oh, I'm going to choose this one. It's a really good one. And then let's select a template for the thank you page as well. I like this one. And done. Now let's go back to the squeeze page. You want to set it up so that when someone opts into this squeeze page, they're automatically tagged, right? So that you don't have to go in and do it manually. So let's go ahead and check out the automation rules and create one together. Select add rule, and then we're going to select funnel form subscribed. Now these triggers are available because of the page that you're working on. Obviously, if you create your automation in automations, there will be far more options. I'll show you a bit more about that in a later video. But for now, select Funnel Step Form Subscribed. Then we need to add an action to this trigger. And we're going to say add a tag. And then we're going to choose the tag we created earlier, Blog Leads. Simply select Save Rule. And there you go. Your automation step has been successfully created on this page. It's as easy as that. Now you can also go and view this rule if you select here, but for now, let's stick to this. You can also create another step, like an opt-in form that could appear on top of your blog. So let's go ahead and select create step. And this one is going to be opt-in form. And let's say we're going to choose between an inline form or a pop-up form. For today, I'm going to choose an inline form. Select save. And there you go. There's another bunch of great templates here. I'm going to choose this one. And there you go, it's all done. We are going to go ahead and edit this page. And I'm going to show you how easy it is to actually edit all of the elements on this page. System uses a really fantastic drag and drop editor on their pages and on their emails, which makes building your pages and your emails so, so simple. As you can see, you simply select whatever you would like, whichever element you want to edit. You can send all the text on it if you choose. You can change the color of certain elements if that's what you would like. So turn this from being red to a yellow button. You can also add elements quite simply by dragging and dropping them to wherever you'd like to place them. On System, you can upload your files and there is no limit to how many files that you can upload. Really, we give you all the space you need. But for now, you can just select that and there you go. You can add your image in whenever you want to. It's a placeholder here. When you are editing a page, we recommend that you use columns. The reason for this is because it keeps all of the elements on your page really well set out so that none of them are in the way and that they're perfectly spaced. As you can see, you can drag and drop these elements into the different places on this and it looks really, really tidy. An awesome way to make sure that your design is effective. Another thing that's important to consider is whether these elements are visible and optimized for both desktop and mobile. That means if somebody is viewing this page on a desktop computer or on their mobile phone, they'll be able to see all of these elements. You can also choose to make some of the elements invisible to them, depending on what device they're using. Select Save Changes, and there you go. Your opt-in form has been created. That's how easy it is to build a simple sales funnel to increase your email list, guys. Seriously, just a few clicks, just a few minutes. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to sell products and make money by creating a sales funnel.